Hi guys! Thanks so much for clicking on over. Um, I haven't done a video in a couple days. I've had a crazy week. I'm so sorry. Uh, I was going to try and fit everything I wanted to talk about today into one video, but I don't think that's going to work. So I think I'll do two videos today. The first thing I wanted to touch on was Swag Saturday. That's a really big thing here at Amateur Attempts. Uh, I did have my very first video ever talking about Swag Saturday and I had a winner for Swag Saturday and I picked her from random.org of all the comments and her name was Charlotte Waymeyer so hi Charlotte thank you so much for watching and your package is in the mail if you want to know what she got go ahead and watch the first Swag Saturday video my first video ever and you can see what she got and because it's so late in the week I didn't want to put up a, another swag Saturday so I'm just gonna wait for Saturday to roll around again and put up two prizes so we'll say swag Saturday 2A and 2B so I'll have two winners on Saturday and I hope you guys all tune in for that um, I wanted to do a tiny little haul and the haul is what gave me the idea for the video I want to do today it's a tiny little benefit haul I got I just got a couple of things the first thing I got was a box powder which I have never owned a benefit box powder so I was really kind of excited to get one I really just went to look but more on that in a second I watched uh, makeup by Tiffany D and she picked this up at Ulta not too long ago. I don't have an Ulta or a Sephora or a Nordstrom's but I do have a tiny little Macy's. So I picked up Benefit Hervana and I really love it. I have a hard time with blush and I have a hard time with bronzer. I own so many which you'll see because my first sort of collection video is going to be on all the blushes I own and because I own so much makeup I'm going to cut it up like that into categories so that's what gave me the ideas because I did pick up a blush now a lot of the blushes from Benefit they're all probably great everybody raves about them some of them seem a little shimmery to me or just kind of not what I'm looking for this one, I'll go ahead and give you a quick look. It has really sort of pretty like a purple and a peach and a mauve and like a champagne-y color. And it's not too frosty and I have it on today. And the reason I bought it was because I had the most sales-oriented saleswoman like attack me I was just looking at these powders and she's like oh are you just looking and I was like yeah I saw something about this blush and I wanted to take a look and she's like oh my god sit down she attacked me with like all this stuff so she's like I'm gonna show you this thing called the Kim Kardashian look what Kim Kardashian does now first of all do I look like I'm into Kim Kardashian nothing against anybody who is but I have zero in common with Kim Kardashian. But apparently everybody on earth wants to look like her. So she's whipping out the lemonade, which I've never used. And she's like, gonna warm it up. And she used it like as a sort of under eye brightener and all that kind of thing. And I'm like, oh, okay, yeah, that's nice. And she did also put this on me and it did look really pretty, which is ultimately why I decided to get it. And she also put uh, hula on as a bronzer now y'all know about hula i have a tiny little like sample of hula that came in a i think sort of a benefit package that i ordered from sephora and so i was able to talk her out of not selling me that because i already have it but she was <laughs> like really pushing this stuff on me so she put the Hervana on me which did look really pretty and I do really like it and I have a really hard time with blush and bronzer and like I said you'll see how much I own and so I am really happy with this hopefully you guys don't think I look like a clown <laughs> but so yay on this I would I would recommend it um it came with this little brush which I knew that benefit box powders came with brushes 
Uh, most people said that they were pretty trashy, but this one seems pretty soft. I like how it's sort of an angle in case you wanted to use it. I will probably never use it because I own like 101 brushes, but you know, if you're in a hurry, it's a good option. And then the second thing I picked up, I wanted, I was kind of looking at the Watts Up. That's their new highlighter. It's kind of a champagne-y color. And, but she talked me into getting this first. It's called Highbrow. And she put that, duh, high on my brow. And it did really sort of brighten up my eyes. And it did really look good. And she put that on and it looked good. And then she's like, more Kim Kardashian. And also she said, oh, and this looks a lot more expensive. And so she, then on top of that, she put some of the watts up. And it did really look nice and it blended in really well. Um, so, you know, I kind of did want to pick that up, but I already dropped $50 on these two things. So in place of the Watts Up, I didn't grab it, but I plan on trying my MAC Color Base in Pearl and seeing if that would be a good substitute to sort of blend in over that. I didn't try that today. But I will, and I will let you know how it goes. So that is my tiny little haul. First things I bought. Um, also moving on, the reason why I have not bought anything in a while and have not been able to do a haul is because <laughs> for Christmas, and some of you might have saw my Christmas picture on Beauty Broadcast, I took a picture of everything that I got for Christmas and everything that I got was makeup related because that is my addiction that is what I want like some people want electronics some people want clothes I want makeup I may not ever use it but just having it makes me feel complete so my husband the sweetheart that he is you know I wrote down names of what I wanted item numbers and I just expected him to get me a few of the things and that man got me every single thing on my list so I have a lot of new brands that I have never used before because like I said we don't have a Sephora or anything like that here and it's hard for me to buy online without looking so I do plan on doing a uh, Christmas gifts haul just because I think a lot of you would be interested in it I did get a ton of stuff and um, I'd like to talk about it and maybe get some comments on what you guys think of it and maybe some good ways to use it. So I think that's going to be it just for this quick video. I just want to do this small haul, tell you that buying the blush gave me the idea to break my collection into segments and do it that way and also tell you why I haven't done a haul as yet and that a Christmas gift haul is coming and that's it you guys so I will get this up I don't have to edit it or anything as long as I don't get cut off and hopefully you guys like it leave me comments and I'm going to get on to my blush collection so thank you so much for watching I will talk to you guys soon I'll make another video and don't forget on Swag Saturday this coming Saturday the 21st we'll have two prizes instead of one. So thanks again guys.